Hello, Slotherin and adult fans of Lego. It's time for another episode of Sloth City. And today, in Sloth City, we have a new business. And it is so exciting because it is our friends, Wayne and Garth, the brothers. And they have realized their dream of becoming business owners, of becoming gem, de gem dealers, of owning their own gem and minerals shop store where they can uh, sell gems and minerals and custom jewelry to the citizens of Sloth City. And look at that beautiful building. Isn't that wonderful? It is so sparkly and so translucent. And, and, and let's go ahead and take a closer look. First of all, it has this nice little balcony on top. It has two stories. Upstairs, we have the workshop, and that is where Wayne is preparing to do something to that interesting lime green gemstone, which might be a peridot, I suppose. It's the only gemstone I know of that is lime green, uh, but I don't know that much about gems. There might be others, but he's there working at his counter in the upstairs of this fine establishment, and down here, through the door, if you open it up, as soon as you look in, you can tell that you are in a gem and mineral store. Because there are gems and minerals everywhere. They are so colorful. They are so rainbow-like. And they are in all of the windows. They are in the display cases. They are everywhere. Isn't that gorgeous? Isn't that a fine, fine gem and mineral store? And there is Garth. And he is manning the counter. And he is preparing to help this fine citizen, and oh, look who is this. It is Yama. We remember Yama. We've seen Yama before. We saw him riding around on a trike with his new boyfriend, Clement. Could he be shopping for some sort of special present for his boyfriend? We don't know, but if so... You heard it here first, guys. Take a look at what might be going on. Isn't that sweet? And you can see all of those beautiful gemstones in there. You can see that there are nice display areas everywhere to, with that nice black background that really makes the colors pop. Isn't that nice? So... We're going to put this back up here and put this back here where you can admire it. I'm going to get out of the street. Isn't that lovely? Isn't that a fine location there next to our government building? And that is not even all I have to show you because this is still a pretty short video. I am going to take just a moment to bring us over to the airport where we have a brand new plane. And there is our fine pilot. And you can see his fine plane with its ginormous engine and its fine propeller and its colorful paint scheme, and its fine checkered patterns on the front and on the tail and on the wings. Isn't that just the coolest looking plane that you've seen in a long time? And look, it has these awesome, awesome wings that fold up and down. Yeah. So take a look at that. So, so cool. And we have also 
put in another road here or street uh, running this way back behind our diner and our post office so that we have access to that area of town as it's being developed. And other than that, I think that we are probably just about... Wait, what is going on here? I guess we're still not done because there is Brett with one of our officers and it looks like they are preparing to engage in a street race to see who has the faster vehicle. And just from looking at the paint job, I would have to go with Brett, but that is a police scooter, so maybe it can scoot along faster than you might expect. I don't know. But we'll have to stay tuned to find out who wins that race. And meanwhile, thank you for coming to this episode of Sloth City, which has not been terribly long, but has many interesting things to look at. Please like and leave a comment if you have been interested and entertained by what's going on in Sloth City, because that gives me some positive reinforcement to keep making these videos. And meanwhile, you have a good day.